Hi, it's Caitlin and I have my swatch video for you for the October For the Love of Polish box. Now this is a box that is sold as a duo exclusively for a 48 hour pre-order window on the Polish for Days website. I will include the details on the exact availability down in the description, but it's a good rule of thumb to remember it always opens on the same day as the Polish pickup and it closes 48 hours later on the Sunday. So that means October 4th through the 6th this time around. And this is also the beginning of a new series, which will only have two boxes in it, October and November, because For the Love of Polish box takes a break in December. And the theme is Nightmare Before Christmas. I know that Jenna is like a huge fan of Nightmare Before Christmas, and I absolutely love what has been created. Like I'm absolutely in love with both of these colors and um, I'm excited for you to see, but um, yeah, I don't know why I'm rambling. Let's just get into the nail polish swatches. We're gonna start with Polished for Days and their contribution to the box, which is called Wake Up Jack. I am swatching both of these polishes on my bare nail and Wake Up Jack is described as a dark purple base with black to red multi-chrome shifting shimmer and holographic flakes. I was immediately impressed by the coverage and evenness on the first coat. And I was also very impressed by the holographicness or rainbowiness of the holographic flakes. They aren't leaning on the silvery side of the spectrum, they're definitely on the holographic side, which is what I always want when it comes to my flakes in polish. And I am using the Polished for Days Crystalline Top Coat. This is a great top coat. It's going to add back some shine. As you can see, the polish dries a tiny bit dull. The top coat will enhance the shine. It will give great longevity to your manicure and it's just very quick drying. So here's a blurry shot so you can see the holographic flakes. And immediately when you get the sun on your nails or any sort of direct lighting source, you're gonna get that red multi-chrome shift, which is just absolutely breathtaking. This polish is very shifty and as you saw, just two coats, so a phenomenal formula. And I love that it is a dark purple base. I think that just adds an extra level of dimension to the polish versus just a black base. So here you can see a whole bunch of different shifts. And the second polish is Polishes Oogie's Turn to Boogie. And again, I'm starting off with my bare nail. And this polish is described as a neon acid green packed with copper to pink to gold to green shifting micro flakes. I I am just in love with the itty bitty little flakes that make up this polish. So the base itself is quite sheer and it does definitely build up and you can wear it at any number of coats as you want, but I'm actually gonna build this up in four coats. And that's not to say that this doesn't have a fantastic formula. It does, I just think that it builds up best in very thin coats. I mean, you can definitely leave it in three, but I was just curious to see what would happen if I added that fourth coat. And I think most people would like it best in four. 
it just makes it even more acidic and deep and green and just very oogie boogie. I absolutely love the sheen on these flakes and I love the color. I love a good greeny chartreuse shade and this one is just so beautiful. I'm also finishing this off with Polish for Days Crystalline Top Coat. It does dry quite shiny, but of course top coat further enhances the shine. This is going to be easy to remove. You might get a few flakes stuck to your fingers but they'll come off easily and i did not experience any staining whatsoever and here you can see how in the light this is just very green very bright very shifty it gets even more green at extreme angles i honestly love this polish and i took a ton of video footage of it in different lighting because it looks so beautiful and different in every type of lighting. I think that Jenna and Shanna did an incredible job of taking this iconic, what would you call it? It's like stop motion film, Tim Burton classic, and created these beautiful nail polishes that are totally in line with that whole universe and the film and the vibe. It's just perfect. It's like, I couldn't think of two more perfect nail polishes, but oh my goodness, I love the polished for days. Can we talk about the black to red multi-chrome and the hollow? It's so rainbowy. I was so happy I was able to catch some sun when I swatched that because the rainbow in the hollow is real. They're not like those silvery flakes. They're very, very rainbowy. And the formula is amazing. The shift from black to red is stunning and I'm obsessed. And it's not to overshadow the polish. I love that green. I love that formulation that Shannon does where it's like these little flakes and they build up. I mean, I did build it up in four coats and I think it's best in four coats and it's worth the four coats. So um, I, I just love it. It's like the perfect shade of boogie boogie. Let me know in the comments what you think of this box. Let me know if you're gonna pick it up. Let me know if you're a fan of the Nightmare Before Christmas. I always think of it as a Christmas movie more than a Halloween movie, so. I mean, I don't know. Is there a debate around that? Maybe that's just me. Anyway, I hope you have a great day wherever you are and hopefully I will see you in the next video. Bye.